Hey Kendra, this is your body party chords. Um, per usual, you you love to pick up pick the, the hard ones, which is fine. I feel like that's how you learn so quickly. Um, so um, the first chord is D major seventh, and that is your favorite a bar chord. And we have the second fret. You your first finger is holding down the whole bar, and then with your third finger, you're holding down the bottom string, uh, fourth fret. Um, this is a pretty little chord. So yeah, first finger is fretting the second, second, uh, second bar, and then your third finger is the bottom string. first chord. And then the bar chord goes down one, so on the first bar, on the first bar here, you're, you're holding down the whole fret, the first fret. And then, I mean, usually you just keep the third finger, you could switch to the second one, but that would just be a lot of complications, because you're only on the second, the second fret, bottom string, uh, holding that down. So it's a pretty little chord. So it's a pretty easy little transition. Uh, and that chord, the second chord, is C sharp seventh. The next chord is F sharp minor ninth, which the chord chart tells you to do one way. I did it a different way. It sounded better. Or you could just straight up do F sharp minor, which is uh, first finger, first fret on the second string right here, and then second finger on the top string, second fret right there, and then the third finger on the third string, the one up from the bottom string. Um, on the second fret. It's this cute little triangle. Uh, so that's F sharp minor. So the chord that I changed it to to make it sound a little more like, because she's got all these like sevenths and ninths and shit, getting all jazzy on a Ciara. Son of a bitch. So the third finger is going to be on the fourth fret on the top string. Uh, the second finger is going to be on the third string, the one from the one up from the bottom on the second fret. And there's a lot of numbers here. So second finger, second fret, string up, one up from the bottom, which I'm calling the third string. And then on the second string, you got the first fret, first finger. This is a pretty little jazzy chord. So you kind of go from the first one to that one to, to that one. So the next two ones are awesome because they're easy. So this one is just first finger on the second string, second fret. And the second, fing second finger on the bottom string, second fret. Super easy. So if you remember the... Chord, it's actually just the G chord with the middle string let go. Super easy. The last chord is awesome because it's so easy. It's the first finger, first fret, second string from the top. Oh my god, that's it. And so uh, it's just going to be some little... So it's this kind of rhythm.
Party. I just realized I didn't tell you the names of those last chords. The last two chords are E minor 7th and A7th. Anyway, I love you.